Hey guys, my name is Gilberto De Leon. Uh, you can call me Gil, that's what my friends and family call me. I am currently stationed in Fort Carson, Colorado. I am an active duty officer, a cavalry officer. And there are several reasons why I decided to record my, record my journey into regenerative farming and ranching. Main one is to inspire others because we need more farmers and ranchers. Um, just if you do simple research, you can, you can realize that we have a serious problem in agriculture. We need more people. We need more young people. Uh, and it's not, not only veterans, we need everybody. And, the, and that leads to my second reason. I'm here just to inspire others because there are a couple of reasons why people don't join this industry. One is the barrier to entry and the capital cost. That alone scares people. And most people want to be or will like to pursue farming and ranching because the, the, the type of lifestyle it provides, but the financial burden scares people away. But I'm here to tell you, it can be done and it shouldn't be a fear at all. Because if we, like anything else, surround ourselves with the proper leaders, people, family, friends, and pursue the right type of education, we can do that. We can reduce that risk. No one can get through life without the without coaches, without mentors, and without, and without account, accountability partners. So I'm here to tell you, it's possible. You can do it because I'm doing it. If I can do it, anybody can do it, trust me. Um, again, I have one year left, and, and in fact, here next week, I'm going to Oklahoma to meet the Martin Brothers, and they have a farm in Marriott, Oklahoma, and Shane Yu from Understanding Ag is going to show up and advise, coach, and enable their ranch. He's going to teach them how to implement regenerative methods. And I'm so happy and so stoked to be part or been afforded the opportunity to be invited to the ranch just so I can observe him teach and mentor the Martin brothers. So again, remember, it, ta it takes the proper connections which you gotta go for and fight for. You gotta surround yourself with the right people, which you gotta go for, for, for. You gotta go and find. That's what it takes. That's what it takes. Nothing's worth pursuing if it's easy. It is gonna be difficult, but I promise you it's gonna be rewarding. And I'm not on the other side yet, but I can tell we will be fulfilled. We want to be good stewards of our land. We want to have dominions over our animals. That's the lifestyle I always wanted to do, wanted, wanted to be part of, but initially I was afraid to, you know, the capital costs and the financial burdens, but not anymore. Hey, it's time for me to transition, and now I'm just going to jump in head first. Um, that's what it takes. I'm going to take the risk. It's not a gamble, it's a risk, because I'm going to surround myself with the proper people and, and, and receive the proper education. Another cool thing about uh, becoming a regenerative farmer or rancher is, like I stated earlier at the beginning, I'm a cavalry officer. So this hat, excuse me, this hat is a Stetson. In, in, in your turn, it's probably a cowboy. But what's cool about this is I get to continue wearing it. I won't be wearing the military uniform anymore. But I get to still wear a Stetson, a cowboy, and carry that legacy. Um, that's, what, that's, that's a pretty cool thing for me that I get to do, and I'm looking forward to finding my next Stetson or cowboy hat as I embark in this incredible and needed journey in regenerative um, in a really regenerative way. I'm looking forward to it. So please stay stay tuned. I'll be posting more videos, especially as I meet Shane Yu and the Mark Brothers, as I observe as as I observe him coaching and mentoring these guys. Again, the education, right? Establishing connect, establishing network, receiving the proper education will only reduce any risk, and you should achieve a favorable outcome, a desired outcome, by doing it by taking the proper steps. So again, my name is Gil. Please stay tuned and looking forward to it. Please join me. And if you're thinking about it, call me. Reach out to me.